Hello and welcome to highlights of stage one of the Giro Donne for 2022, the 33rd edition of the race. Calgary on Sardinia, the venue for stage one, the 4.7 kilometre individual time trial. An informed Georgia Baker of Team Bike Exchange, Jayco. She's had a victory in the Touringen stage race and finished third in the recent individual time trial at the Tour de Suisse. She would come in towards the finish and knock Mariana Voss off the top of the leaderboard. Her final time of 5.49, averaging 48.481 kilometres an hour. Elisa Longaborghini, yet again Italian and national time trial champion, got her ride underway. She's had stage wins and a finished second overall in her home tour. Clearly aspirations on taking this race overall in what is a busy season. She crossed the line just over five seconds down on Georgia Baker and her time of 5.51 would eventually be good enough for fourth place. Elisa Balsamo, world road race champion, out of the rainbow bands and back into the colors of Trek Segafredo for the individual time trial. Balsamo, a fabulous track rider. She came in towards the finish. It wouldn't be quick enough today to knock a Georgia Baker off the top of the leaderboard, but her 551 would be eventually be good enough for third. Kristen Faulkner of the USA and Bike Exchange, Jayco, is on superb form so far this season. Individual time trial victory in the Tour de Suisse. She wore the yellow jersey before gave way and finished second in that race to Lucinda Brand. But she started the Giro the way she means to go on. It was a 5.45 ride, averaging 49.043 kilometers an hour. Starting early on, as many riders did due to the forecast of the wind getting up later in the day, it would be a long day in the hot seat for the USA rider. Lotta Kopecky, Belgian time trial champion, great time trialist as well. The Giro Donne special for her. 2020, that stage victory really was the catalyst for the growth of Lotta Kopecky on the road. She came in towards the finish. It would be a 5.51 ride, averaging 48.205. It would be good enough for fourth place. The final rider of the day to start was Lonica Uniken. And as she came in towards the finish, it was clear she wasn't going to beat the American, finishing 34th in the time trial. The stage win and the first Malia Rosa of this year's race goes to the USA's Kristen Faulkner and Team Bike Exchange, Jayco. There's confirmation of your top 10 on the stage. Kristen Faulkner takes the stage ahead of teammate Georgia Baker with Elisa Balsamo third at five and a half seconds. Kopecky, Longa, Borghini, Van Vluten, Brand, Marcus, Thomas and Costa, your top 10. It's a special moment. Kristen Faulkner onto the podium for her first Giro Donne stage victory. Teammate Georgia Baker in second and Italian and world road champion Elisa Balsamo in third. The GC now looks like this. Four seconds separating the top two, six to third and fourth, with 12 seconds separating the top 10 overall. Big day for Kristen Faulkner of the USA, the first Malia Rosa of the 33rd edition of the Giro Donne. Belongs to the rider from the USA.